Well, good morning, everyone. Thanks for joining. Uh, I've been working on this car for several years now, so we're very, very excited to share it with you. We think you're going to be very, very impressed with the car today. So let's get started. Why electrify the soul? Now, when we started this project, we had lots of different options, but um, the soul really lends itself to electrification or electromobility because it's cool, it's iconic, it's become a signature vehicle for Kia. Um, it also has a great nimble size that works for urban EV markets, whether you're in the United States or Europe or Asia. And what it really creates is a unique blend of efficiency and utility and function. And we've got a state-of-the-art lithium-ion column battery, produces 27 kilowatt hours of energy. It's more than LEAF, more than Focus, more than I3. Um, and it's possible because of the density um, of, of the, um, the energy density within the cell, and I'll talk about that in a minute. But the cool thing is, is because we have so much energy crammed into a small space, the battery doesn't intrude on uh, the cabinet space. We've worked with SK Innovation, our battery partner, to develop the battery specifically for this car. And it uses a nickel cobalt manganese cathode. That's the same material, incidentally, that's used in the BMW i3 and will be used in the next generation Chevy Bolt. The anode, the negative side of the battery, uses a carbon graphite material, and both of these are bathed in a gel, a unique gel electrolyte. So, uh, we've got a lot of energy density crammed into a very small space. And our engineers worked on um, a very stable um, energy density over time. So when we promise you a certain amount of range, it remains there. Uh, they also focused on thermal stability and stable distance to empty. And the stable distance to empty, again, comes from the chemistry. And what we get out of that is when you're driving the car, you don't see the distance to empty freak out. Oh my god, you've got 30 miles. No, no, wait, it's actually 50. No, wait, it's 70. So it's very stable. And then finally, there's a great safety story where the battery has an uh, overcharge protection device built into it, and there's uh, fuses for each voltage sensing line. If there's any problem, the fuses snap and it cuts the power to the battery immediately. This is the battery pack for the 2015 Soul EV. Now, the way it's constructed is it fits underneath the car. There's a clamshell cover that's been taken off so we can reveal what's inside. There's eight modules that compose this battery. There's, there's a bank of four here, and there's a bank of four that go over here. They've been removed. And um, in each module are these cells. Now, there's 192 of these cells uh, in the entire battery pack. And the cool thing is that um, these cells hold so much energy, they're, they're very, very energy dense. So the entire pack, when it's all put together with the modules and everything, fits up tight under the body of the car doesn't really consume that much interior space. In fact, very, very little of the rear floor space is actually consumed by the, uh, the battery. And um, uh, it's very, very efficient. It produces 27 kilowatt hours of energy, 360 volts, which drives the car 93 miles of EPA certified range.